What you doing? Doing video. You live? <laughs> We're, we're filming but I can delete it out. <laughs> good morning. No, it's not good morning. Good afternoon. This is Kathleen Pate at my Alabama Farm Life and I'm here with my son Winslow and uh, we're off to feed the chickens. Here we go. I have Winslow up early letting out the chickens and collecting eggs. One of the first and most important things that we do in the morning on the farm. The next thing we do is go down to the garden and look for damage and worms on the tomatoes. Now we've been finding damage on our watermelons so we have decided to put out the traps. We're baiting it with cantaloupe and I had them up here by the watermelon. However, we ended up changing our location because we weren't having any luck. Up there for a check. What? So weird. Wait, that's a porcupine. Yeah. That's I wonder. I wonder if he's overheated. He's not, he's not moving. Probably overheating. He's been out here for a while. Yeah. So as you can see, we were successful on our first trapping. However, um, we did not check the trap enough, and the poor thing died. It was really hot outside. So that was our fault and we won't be making that mistake again. I love you. How you doing? Good. I feel bad. So cute. Oh yeah. I feel bad too. Poor guy. We should have checked earlier. I forgot. The only reason I wanted to check is because I wanted to make a video. They're always over here. Oh yeah, like, uh, we ain't guilty. They look guilty to me. Oh, we want to wait for her. Are we digging in the compost? That looks like it, yeah. They're turning it for you. Oh, they are. Look how pretty that, look how pretty it is. Yeah, right? I told her everything. See, though, we're checking our books. Is that a porcupine? It looks a bit spicy. Looks like he uh, died of overheat. Died of overheat. Or he's probably playing Zen. Let's re release it right here. I don't think I should, you should go in there. Oh, you could carry it. Me? Yeah. Oh, how far are we going? Uh, let's stop it right here. Alright. I can't carry. You wanna play with it? Over here you said? Yep. <laughs> yeah. yeah, break it down. Just throw these up. Just come all the way over. There's a bar. That's right, you push this bar back. Go away, bees. Bring it up. Like that, right? Mm-hmm. What am I missing? And then put that bar in there? This bar right here? Yeah, put it underneath it. Underneath it? No, right? no, pull it up. It won't do anything. Yeah, well, pull it up. Pull it up. Not that bar. Oh, like that. There we go. Yeah, okay. All right. Let me just dump it out. All right, the big boy rooster let himself out. He could, he could fly out, right? He's not gonna chase us. He's scared of us. No, he's sick. Yeah, he attacked mom, but we whack him with a stick. On, you don't have to run. If you run, he's gonna chase you. Just walk on the stay on the side. Just stay on my side. He's scared of me. Come on, go, go, go. Who's a big boy? He's such a pretty bird. He looks he's running. Yeah, he's running away. He's such a pretty bird though. He is, I love his color. Run. Beautiful. <laughs> Beautiful bird. Majestic. You gotta make sure you don't turn your back, though. 
So after disposing of our unfortunate little groundhog, we went ahead and put some more cantaloupe in the trap and we set it back out to see what else yeah, we can catch. Yeah, he's the same size as the other one. I pulled you over. Because you're eating my shit in my garden. It's all right, I'm not gonna hurt you. All right, let's go, buddy. He didn't even eat all the cantal cantaloupe. You can't get out, right? No. Right. You get him good? Yep. You do not want to touch this, Vincent. It will bite you up. Want me to get it or you got it? Right. Right, here we go. I said stand back here. The journey needs to get in shade while we drive down there, but not a long drive. It'll be a long, pretty short drive. Okay. It's pretty short. Right over here's okay? Yeah, see if that's okay. Um, okay over here. Maybe in the woods. You want me to do it? So push the bar down and then release. Mm -hmm. So this is the second critter that we have captured. We have captured a third one and we're setting up the trap again for today. We uh, don't want any more woodchucks in our garden. They cannot heat up all our watermelons. We really want watermelons this year. So I want to go ahead and say thank you to everyone that has been watching my channel. I really do appreciate you guys. We're done. Okay guys, that's it for this video. You guys have a great day. We'll see you on the next one. He's bleeding. He's bleeding? Yeah. Throw him in the back of your car? Yeah, we can put him in the back of the car. Okay. Yes, ma'am. All right, here we go. Okay. Just go. You hear him making that chittering sound? That means he's like stressed and he wants to bite you. He hurt himself. Yeah, he's bleeding on his nose. All right, hold on, wait, Vincent. We gotta set up the fence again. But when we release? Yeah, we're gonna release him by the 